Brothers and sisters, comrades and friends, I'm Cuba Libre. Let's finish Unreal. Now last time, we worked our way through the Scourge Mothership and blew the hell out of their main reactor, which is where this crater is right now, in a pretty cool, uh, scripted sequence, which is not many of in this game, but some. And now things are very dark. I'm gonna try and find that searchlight thing. Ugh. What I'm hoping it is is an infinite energy flashlight. I don't necessarily want to go down there. These little things are all loose. I think what's happened is that every uh oh god, there's one on the ceiling. every force field that was on the ship is now open. So I definitely don't want to go all the way back down to those prison blocks. What the hell is that? That thing looks horrible. Okay, what I need to remember is where that auxiliary power thing was. And... The best way I can think of to get to it is to go back to the big generator room, if I can. And go into that door that, uh... That door that opened up after I killed all those warping dudes. Jesus Lord! God, I hear so many bad guys. Ow! Oh. Shield. Ow. Oh man, I'm almost out of this ammo. I didn't realize that. Okay, that's where that door was. There's no that's where I gained access to the auxiliary power room. So I'm just gonna go down here. What? I don't know what that is. Didn't save him from two flag shots in the face, though. So I think... Yeah, it was down here. The only good thing about the rocket troopers I have... Oh god, I'm completely out of hit scan weapons. That's no good. Also, I see you, jerk. I don't think I don't see you. I don't like that thing. It looks deadly. Okay, luckily this still works, I suppose. Jesus, this guy's tough. Oh god, what the f- Get me out of there. Jesus, who is this boss? God damn, dude. Ouch. Alright, well this is the door. Any supplies around? No. I'm running low on ammo for stuff. At least for my preferred things. Okay, what does this say? The source antechamber. Oh, that's where I want to be. So the question is, how do I get into it? So the searchlight is draining power very slowly. Whoa. That is a cool looking thing. But it's quite slow. So I'm going to turn it off now because there's some ambient light in here. Authorization granted. Activate the emergency power supply. How did... okay. How did it grant me authorization? You'd think it... 
Oh, whatever. Okay, so now this is... Oh, no. Oh. Guess, guess that's emergency power. It is now activated. Good. And now the source antechamber is open. What is the source? We are now in the source antechamber. <laughs> By Enox. Okay, so that is obviously something we need to open. Just want to check both ways and make sure... Uh-huh. Oh, great. Yeah, just fucking do it. Just do it. God damn, that's dumb. So annoying. Oh, look where we are. I'll go... Okay, people, we're back. Oh, God. This time this guy spawned on this side. Not what I was expecting. Come on. Yeah! Right into the minefield. Jerk. I'll just keep the bio-rifle out. I'm starting to like the bio-rifle more and more. It definitely, uh... Hurts people, but oh, okay. I was like, I'm pretty sure I hit the button, but in super close quarters like this, hmm. Don't know what I'm supposed to be looking for here. Oh, yes, I will take supplies. Thank you very much. Uh, I think my assault vest is already full. Uh, whatever. Uh oh, the music's playing. Oh, whoa. What is going on? This is totally scripted. I'm, uh... Can't control the camera. Holy shit. What is even ha What? Whoa. I am now at the source. By Jeremy War. Okay, I'm saving again. Okay, that looks kind of like a thing that could be called a source. Alright, that looks horribly dangerous. I am not going out there. I will pick up some ammo though. Huh. So I can come out here and get lots of supplies if I need them. I definitely don't want these things following me. Yes, if I can just go with them into falling off, that would be nice. See ya. <laughs> what I don't want them just doing is jumping off while I'm trying to have some horrible final battle. And, uh, having to deal with them. So obviously the source is where these, I think, it's pretty clear now that these things are like baby scourge. <laughs> they all knocked each other off, that was pretty funny. Um, holy Jesus, this is creepy. Jump boots, what does that mean? I hope I don't super jump boots. Interesting. Well, that's a... Th oh no! fucking teleports. Oh, God. Now I'm creeped out. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, no. Oh, God, it's up there. Oh, it's so... There. Do not like 
the way it teleports around at all. Not a fan. Not a fan. Ooh. Oh god. I think those little things are just gonna keep coming after me. Whoa! The eight ball's pretty good with the shield, not because it goes through the shield. But because by the time it fucking reaches him, the shield's off and gone, and it hits him anyway. Oh, I see you. I guess it gives you super jump boots so you can follow him around to the upper levels, but fuck that, he can come to me. I just wanna make sure that's not a hole in the ground. Get to you, little jerk. No, Oh shit, he's dead. Uh, um... Nope. Is this the way out? It's coming. It's coming. Back off. Oh god, it's a... some kind of escape... thing? Okay, alright. Yes, to that place. It's not Earth, there's two moons. <laughs> Maybe it's the Nali, Napali, the Nali planet. Okay, searchlight off. I'm very prepared for an alien-esque final battle inside the chamber. No? I think we may have made it. We killed the source. I guess that was like some kind of queen thing, as evidenced by all the larva around. That's the source of all the scarge. Whoa. That is a very complicated escape tunnel. Whoa. This seems inefficient. If the point is to escape. Oh. It is going, literally going through the clouds, clipping through the clouds. Or no, oh, okay. That was its way of launching into space. The Scarge escape pod has broken free from the planet's gravitational pull, barely. Yet its fuel has depleted, and you drift aimlessly. Hmm. Nice music. From where many have died, you have escaped. You laugh to yourself. So much has happened, but little has changed. Before the crash landing, you were trapped in a cramped cell. Now, 
Once again, you are confined in a prison. Ah, irony. Delicious, dramatic irony. But, you feel confident that someone will come upon your small vessel. Eventually. I hope there's food in there. Maybe you can eat that bio stuff <laughs> in the bio rifle. Until then, you drift and hope. That's a pretty terrible fate. Not that it matters. Your person has no... I mean, the, the game doesn't have much of a plot. It has an atmosphere. It has a... to be continued. Yeah. It has a... Uh, <clears throat> it has rich and fantastic world building, which is what video games are best at, if you ask me. But, uh... You know, your character doesn't really have any motivation except to, to escape, I guess. And that's it. The end. Um, to escape, and... I guess this is the only way that your character can figure to escape, is to find the escape pod in this heart of the Scarge Mothership. Seems weird, but there you go. Also, if I'm such a horrible force that I've annihilated, like, all the Scars that there are, you'd think the Queen would use the pod, presumably that's why it's there, to get away from me to continue her race, but whatever. So apparently there's this, uh, expansion, Return to Napali. Never played it, unlike the main game. Um, uh, didn't even know there was one, frankly, so I'll probably be doing that next. Um... Yeah, the 2B continued as such a tease. I would have loved if they had made more real Unreal games. Real Unreal games. Unreal Real games? Uh, but unfortunately, Unreal 2 is just a big old piece of mediocre garbage. Maybe I'll LP it at some point. I'll definitely buy it and not spend money on it. Unless it's on good old games, maybe. But, uh... Yeah, it just totally killed the single player uh, part of this series. So, anyways, I'm Cuba Libre. Visit me next time when we return to Napali. See you guys later.